The biggest names in tech are in Vegas this week for CES. Yahoo Finance's Dan Howley met up with Samir Samat, vice president of Android Ecosystem at Google. Samat addresses consumer changing consumer expectations and what's new at Android. One thing that's great about CES that I've always found is, you know, the industry comes together. We get to see everything that's new. One of the things that is clear is that the is that CES and all the devices here are reacting to changing consumer expectations, and that's really what our discussion here in our Android space is all about. And that is, all the devices in your life, and the average U.S. consumer now has over 25 connected devices. All of those devices working better together,、mm-hmm. uh, and we really think that Android is a leader in that. We've always had an open ecosystem,、mm-hmm. uh, and that's when partnership. With the industry and bringing those devices together and making sure that you can get what you need done across all of them. So, you know, we had some pretty cool announcements here.、Um, first, there's some things we've talked about for、uh, a year or so that we've been doing to make things work better together.、Mm-hmm. Uh, we have some momentum around that. So, fast pair. That's how headphones and other devices connect to each other. This just did a、uh, Google I/O, right? That's right. Yep. We announced、uh, that there's、uh, over 300 million, 300、uh, t- types of headphones that now have adopted fast pair, which is pretty cool. It's not I- bad. I asked the team how many fast pairings went on last year. Like, just give me the number. And it was 320 million. So that's pretty cool、uh, to see that consumers are doing that. Cast is now supported by over 3,000. Uh, apps,、mm. which is pretty neat,、uh, and then on top of that, nearby share, which is the way that you and I can take our Android devices and share a file, like a picture or a document, with each other, is now rolled out on over three billion devices. So those are pretty cool things from a mo- momentum standpoint about how、uh, the Android ecosystem is coming together. But we also had some new features that we announced.、Uh, one of them was、uh, all about our media controller, and it's just a small example of how we're trying to make it really easy. For you to move media and audio between all the different connected devices in your life, so with that new media controller, you can easily move to any device that supports Cast、mm. or、uh, any Bluetooth connected device as well. And we're doing this with YouTube and YouTube Music. One of the things I'm super excited about is our partnership with Spotify.、Mm. Uh, and we announced that partnership last year—a very deep technical collaboration where we can innovate together on the Android platform. Uh, and one of the things we've been working on together is getting that media controller to support Spotify Connect. So if you've got devices that you've connected with Spotify Connect, really soon you'll be able to use the media controller to basically put your media and seamlessly switch between all those things, which is super exciting and cool. So if I have something in my bedroom,、uh, I have you know、uh, a speaker in my kitchen. I can say, all right, I want to bounce between the the bedroom and the kitchen. Maybe I want to you know listen to some. I don't know metal while I cook. I don't know why. And <laughs> why not metal while I clean the bedroom? Just a lot of metal, or you know, pop punk or something. I can just easily bounce between those. That's right. So you know, I mean, if you come home from work and you're you're driving in your car and you're listening to to to、uh, to your your metal <laughs> or whatever tunes or you're interested in, or, you know, yeah, whatever you, whatever floats your boat. Uh, you know, you you want to walk into the house and you want to continue rocking out. You know, and so you should. It should be really easy to move that to your living room, to your kitchen. And maybe when someone tells you to knock it off and it's too loud, switch it to your earbuds and and continue. The media controller makes it super simple to do that now with all the connectivity that we've built in, support from Cast and all of that. So it's really easy, and that's just a good example of how all the devices in the Android ecosystem come together. And we have obviously some autos behind us. Where where is Android slotting in there? I know we already have Android Auto. What's what's going on in that respect? Well, you know, I think there's a there's a real fundamental change in consumer expectation right now. And what's happening is that you know the phone is the center, but we're all expecting the phone to be able to be useful throughout your day, through all the devices that you connect with. And that's really what I think fundamentally we're here talking about at CES. And that's no different than with your car.、Mm. You know, your car you now expect to be Fully connected. You expect your phone to be able to be your key. You expect your media to transfer seamlessly, and so we're working with manufacturers to make all of that happen. And I think they're just responding to what we're all responding to, which is the changing consumer. You know, I have young kids, and to be honest, if the screen that they're looking at, if you touch it and it doesn't work as a touch screen, they're like, "This is broken." Oh yeah. And yeah. It, and if you talk to some, a device and it doesn't respond back to you, they're like. What's wrong with this? My、thing? my nephew is constantly saying "Hey Google" and then play the Spider-Man theme song. So I yeah I get it. <laughs> right, I totally get it. So I think that's what we're working on with not just the auto manufacturers but also 
the TV industry and, uh, and more. Awesome, Samir, thank you so much for joining us here at CES 2023. We really appreciate it. I really appreciate it.